What's up you guys? This is Adam Gillespie with Rancid and Sweaty Calves coming at you with yet another video. And wouldn't you know it, I was right. I told you guys I was right. They're coming after your children. They always are. And I do mean that in more than just one way. But I will not specify which one I'm talking about. Therefore, you can guess in the comment section below. Little game you can play. She-Hulk director Kate Corio, or Cat Corio, I'll say, says production team wanted to make the series about a woman navigating sex, but also something that everyone can enjoy, including children. We knew this was happening, we knew this was going on, and yet it's still shocking that they think it's so okay to act like this, that they are going to actively speak out loud about their intentions to groom children. Their intentions to manipulate the minds of young kids. They wanted to purposely make a movie, uh, not a movie, a show about a sex-positive, whorish woman who goes out and sleeps with, I think, three guys in a total of four episodes and, and, and brings one of her one-night stands to a family gathering and they wanted to market that towards kids. And on top of that, they want to market horrible attitudes, horrible ideologies, horrible political agendas, horrible uh, actions, horrible everything to kids. They are actively trying to do this. We knew this was going on, and yet it's still shocking that they feel so brave to come out and say it in broad daylight. That's disgusting. It's disturbing. It's horrendous. It's the most annoyingly disgusting and intrusive thing that you could possibly think about. And they're doing it in broad daylight and actively talking about it on podcasts, in, in, in newsletters, in interviews. They're disgusting, evil human beings. And it needs to stop. And I'm so happy that Marvel is floundering right now because they need to be put to an end. They need their, uh, their, their movies, their TV shows, their entire industry to fall apart around them. We need to, as fans, vote with the dollar to make sure that they can't push this bullcrap onto kids anymore because it's disgusting. And we all know that comic books, movies, and TV shows like this with superheroes are the target audience is always majority children. That's why parents bring their kids to the movies opening weekend when there's a new Marvel or DC film that comes out. Because it's always targeting kids. It's almost always about getting those kids in the seat so they can watch these big, awesome, iconic heroes on the screen doing some awesome heroic things. And yet their main goal with this show was to introduce a sex-positive, whorish bent to children. That needs to stop. And we as fans have the power to make it stop by voting with our dollar. So... Continue to vote with your dollar, continue to give these guys hell, and continue to make them wish they didn't mess with the fandom like they have. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, let me know what you think about this situation, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification icon, and also, share this video out there with your friends. Boy, am I out of breath because I'm pacing back and forth and this is annoying. All right. <clears throat> Also, you can follow me over on Rumble and Patreon. I'll leave links to those in the description below. I hope you guys have a great day and a great rest of the week.